All right, happening this month, October is National Arts and Humanities Month. So joining us in studio with more on the events happening around Kern County and across California, we have Andrea Hansen, the Executive Director of the Kern Dance Alliance and Program Director of the KDA Creative Corps. People don't realize that that's Kern Dance Alliance doing all of these different things, so much more than just dance. Tell us how you're celebrating this month. Yes, so October is National Arts and Humanities Month. It's an opportunity to celebrate our artists, our culture bearers, as well as our teachers, our historians, those that help to make our community so much better through arts and humanities. And KDA is participating in the celebration by announcing all the things that we're up to in partnership with so many arts organizations, not just in Kern County, but across the Central Valleys and across the state of California. I just love that. And one of the opportunities is for our young dancers and for our high school students don't necessarily have to be a dancer to get involved with KDA. Yeah, if you have an interest really in nonprofit work, if you have an interest in learning how to administer a nonprofit, KDA currently has an opening for our student internship program. This is a year long of service that will start in January of 2025 and, when, and it will go all the way through December of 2025. The applications are currently open to become a student intern with the organization. High school students, college level students, interested in nonprofit work, interested in, in arts administration, this internship is for you. It looks great on your resume mm -hmm. and it's fantastic for your college admissions. KernDance.org forward slash get involved. That's where you can access the application and those applications do close on November 1st. November 15th. November 15th. Yes. Okay. Okay, so we have a little less than a month, and then coming up in December is Open Stage. I love this program. Tell us all about yeah, it. Yeah, Open Stage is all about making the historic Bakersfield Fox Theater accessible to creatives throughout Kern County. You can apply to rent the Fox Theater for free and to use the theater in any way that you would like. Maybe you want to put on a show. Maybe you want to collaborate with another artist in the community. Maybe you're going to film the next TikTok craze. <laughs> so you can literally use the theater for all the things. We've had ballerinas. We've had musical theater. We've had folklore. We have all different types of creatives on that stage, and not just on stage, all throughout the theater. You get access to the theater for free and access to their technical amenities for free. So there's only three spots left for open stage. So if you're interested in renting the stage for free, kerndance.org forward slash open stage, three spots left, and those applications close on November 1st. I just love this. And we were talking with one of the organizations that brought their young students up, and they'd never been on a stage before. And to look out over those seats and have the lights on them. It was just such a beautiful feeling for them and a confidence booster. How exciting is it for you? Yeah, I mean, there's no secret. I mean, the Fox Theater is one of our most famous stages and a lot of famous feet have been on that stage. So for a child to step foot on that stage for the first time and understand what it's like to be in front of all 1,500 seats with the lights on your face and know that some of the most famous people have stood on that stage as well, it's a confidence booster. And more important, it's an imagination maker. And it's something that's going to boost um, their creativity and their ingenuity to become something very special in their future as well. I just love it. See, so perfectly <laughs> said, kerndance.org, all the information, including those applications. Thank you, Andrea. Thank you, Elena.